Hello, we beautiful people, and welcome back to Let's Play Atlas Fallen. Whoa, okay, that was sh oh, Yep, um, I was for a second afraid that I would fall down, if I'm utterly honest. But now, okay, that's the way, right? Yeah, I was really afraid of not making the jump. That is not always possible for me, since I sometimes screw up immensely for whatever reason which is oftentimes clumsiness stupidity you know the usual stuff do we have anything let's have a quick no 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 don't fall down even though if you would only lose HP that would be fine but let's see if there's anything of use down, or not down here, but around here. Chest, yep, always much appreciated. Money, like that. nothing up there then we go straight to the other side well straight so to say you know boop, boop. yeah there was a oh, wait can I use the line that would be pretty damn much of, no. how the heck I'm lost, forgive me. Like that, okay. Good, good, good. I have a bad feeling about this place. My feeling also. I sense something here, watching us. Well, it's a big arena. I can only imagine <laughs> that there's gonna be a little, little bit of a fight here. Which is actually kinda not that good. I have to admit I haven't played this game in a week. Um, or even two. It has its reasons. The usual reason. Time. So I'm still a little bit hard on, not hard, but a little bit cold on them controls. Which you probably already have noticed more than usual important part and um, different games came in the anvil you know something is dragging it down in the sand curse the loss the fiends are everywhere I just wanted to use the health potion. Oh god, that was uh, that could yeah restart the count and en encounter. That could have I could have done that if stupidity, clumsiness, coldness wouldn't have struck. That fight is possible right now. If I don't be stupid again. Come on, spiker blocking. Oh so important too.
I do not know why I'm... Oftentimes is that stupid. With just blocking the right moment thing. Yeah, one more try on record and then I'm gonna move on to the offer and make the fight. The thing is, I was for one bare second really, really happy because I thought it's done the battle and then obviously second stage comes in. Alright, good. Be careful blocking, my friends. I think blocking is what you should do. Worked out good. Oh, that was the last second oh, defeat. That was a lot. You acquitted Deadly. yourself well. Be proud. Now I am. Let us retrieve this anvil from under the sands. There are more memories around here. You should learn about them. I am ready. Show me. Long before this world became what it is today, gods walked Atlas. But these were not simpler times, as there was discord among them. One wanted humans to be their equals, and they forged tools for them to be free from the gods. But the other didn't trust humans with weapons. They wanted the people under their protection. Under their control. It was then that the God of Chaos forged a great weapon. A gauntlet that would rival Thelos' power. They challenged Thelos, and their battle ravaged the Earth changed it forever. The loss prevailed. They shattered their enemy and imprisoned them into a realm of endless struggle from which they would never, ever break through. Thus, the story of the other god was lost, and nobody now remembers the god of chaos. This, I remember now, parts of it. You are a god? The 
God of Chaos? Chaos? No. I am the God of Freedom. Change. How can Chaos bring forth something good? It is destructive. It destroys the old, yes. And only then something new can arise. Something free, untamed. Without chaos, there is no freedom, and the world becomes stale as it is today. Is the Queen really our enemy? She did spell the Knight's Doom. There is no way to know what she might do next. We need to face her somehow. Only she knows the truth about this world. So... You have fought Thelos? With the aid of humans. A human who carried the gauntlet. It was not enough. You're... not really inside this thing? No. I created the gauntlet. But it seems to be only a vessel for my spirit. I am... trapped somewhere. In a prison of Thelos' design. We should look around for more hints about Valerie. Alright, and that was... It's always that there's something with the... I mean, if I think about... Didn't we... Ah, we find Air Dash. That... Anyways. If I remember Forspoken, obviously, without trying to spoil anything, there was something off with the... First of all, we need to find whereabouts and investigate the research camp, which we will do. There was something off with the gauntlet, and obviously here a little Old bit too, too at least. Essence stones. So she was researching them. It looks like she got quite far. Not that there is anything for us to learn from this, but still. But still. Chest much appreciated. There's a Come lot of stuff here. In here. This armor looks usable, and there's a journal. It seems Valerie went towards the capital. But the journal is missing pages. We could look for them if you feel the need, but this should already be enough for Kendra. That should be everything. We should improve the gauntlet and get out of here. All right, Dead Eyes attire, that sounds nice. A season's, um, I, I mean, how the armor is called. A season's hunter attire granted as well protection to track all types of wild creatures using Atlas's burning sun. A comb in the shape of Thelos? Hmm. Why would Valerie have this? That is a pretty damn good question. One place. Did Valerie collect them down here? I think we found everything. Let's improve the gauntlet and get out of here. All right, we will improve the gauntlet, obviously you guys, in the next episode. Let us just see. Yep, we are gonna have to use the gauntlet, the anvil, the gauntlet. I just wanna check for the last remaining seconds. Let's have a oh, minute. Let's have a quick look around. I will try out the armor in the off. And then we improve the gauntlet obviously obviously in the next episode for now you guys that right now brings us to the end of today's episode and you know it i as usual really really think i would like to open up that door but that's gonna be opened up maybe in the next episode for now you know it i as usual really really thank you for watching if you guys actually do have enjoyed today's episode then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe and hopefully and hopefully i see you in the next episode until then i wish you all a wonderful day stay frosty bye